going to be for Joe Love and Mr. Bingo. I'm going to play some old job, new job. <laughs> so in this game, um, each of these folks had an occupation. One of them is going to teach the other a new occupation. It can be any occupation you want. What occupation does Mrs. Lee want to have? Escalator repairman. Escalator repair technician. Okay. What about Joe Love? Union buster. <laughs> How do I not take that? Yeah. Union busting is wrong, but I'm going to take it for the sake. All right. Let's 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 see. Um, who did we say was learning the new job? You're learning the job. So, this is me, Bob. I'm just going to teach Joe Love how to do escalator repair. I'm so excited. It's my new first day at my new job. I get so tired of busting unions. Sometimes I bust back. But, okay, um, hello. Uh, I can't read the book they wrote your name, so I, I'm sorry I can't introduce myself properly. Oh, sorry. Here, go ahead. It's your name? No, no, it's your name. Oh, that explains it. <laughs> <laughs> Linda, <laughs> huh? Linda Hump. Yeah. 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 Okay. 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 Okay, Linda Hump. I'm ready. I'm ready. All right. I'm going about escalator repair. Yeah. So here's the escalator. Yeah. The first thing you want to know is that it's very hard to tell between a broken escalator and stairs. <laughs> <laughs> They're both the same, but one has potential. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I feel. Yes. So you're, what you're going to do is you take the belt, and the belt goes all the way up. It's like a railing piece, and you're so usually that gets caught, right? Ooh, that, that hurt. Not caught, but like on someone. Okay. It just gets caught like in itself. Ooh. You know, like it has a, you know. So you basically you take it and you un. Here, give me the screwdriver. Okay, there you go. Does this come in handy for busting unions? Oh, you have no idea. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so you undo the panel. And you just press this button. It's green. And it should just start going. Yeah. Yeah. It will look good right all the way to the top. <laughs> I'm going to be the best escalator repairman that ever was. Well, I have all the come down and. Oh, yeah. And, you know, I'm not making much of it. Oh, let me try this one. This one. Okay. Let me give you a tip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can walk down the escalator as it's moving. I tried. Oh, yeah, but I didn't go anywhere. In fact, I think I re regret. All right, you were walking the wrong way. You know, mm -hmm. when you walk backwards of an escalator that's going down, you actually stay in place. Okay, yeah, I think I got that. <laughs> right, it's complicated. It is complicated. You know, busting unions probably does not take a lot of intelligence. <laughs> no. <laughs> that's why they hired me. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. What do we do if the problem is in the belt? Where else might there be problems? Um, you know, there could be problems in the little thing that brushes your shoes as you go by. It's on every stair. Ooh. Yeah, okay. Um, there could be like a small animal trapped in there. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you, so you take your scissors here. Yeah, okay. And you, you just cut, just pretend there's an animal there. There's not. It's a duck. It's a duck. Okay. <laughs> You're creative! Um, yeah, just cut it out. Not, okay, cut what out. I'm not yeah, saying anything wrong. I was, okay, I was not clear. You're gonna to wanna to cut around the duck, not for him. Cut the thread? No, you're gonna cut the the little the little brush of bristles out of it. Yes. It'll have to be replaced, yeah. Yes, there, okay. it's like there's gum in your hair. Oh no. No, no, no. <laughs> You're right, there is. You're not sitting on the metaphors. What? Uh, never mind. Okay. <laughs> I never meant for I didn't want. You know <laughs> Just give me the scissors! <laughs> Oh, thanks. 
Thank you. Hey, happy to be a servant. Good, yeah. Okay. Serves you right. <laughs> All right, so those are the main two problems that come with escalators. Okay. Uh, but there's there's another one. Termites. So old escalators. <laughs> They're made, of, they're made of a little bit of wood. Yeah. Okay. And like the stairs, they're made of a little bit of wood. Mm -hmm. So one time, um, this little kid came on and he and he, his foot went right through the stairs. Uh, it really hurt him okay. and our company. So what you're gonna want to do it. Company kind of deserved to get through. Uh, <laughs> uh, we had to all work through holidays and weekends. We didn't get paid any extra. Anyway, okay. so you're gonna want to take your uh, wood knife. And you're gonna to want to cut out the rot and the termite thing. Okay. All right. So just keep doing it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cool, little guy. Yeah. There. That, you yeah. actually did it right. Hey. What a surprise. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't it be easier just to set the whole thing on fire? <laughs> you think so? But that was against our rules. It's not any rules. 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 Everywhere. I know. Rule. <sighs> Well, it was against the okay. It's not anymore. You technically could burn it down. There would be no repercussions, but it would damage the escalator. It would be smoke all over. There would be in your lungs. You don't want it. Is that a repercussion? Smoke yes. Lungs? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Some people are fine, but okay. So you're gonna want to dispose of this. Um, just put it in like a trash bag and then tie it up, tie the trash bag up, and then just put it put it to the side. Okay. okay. I'll do that. Yeah. When we get home. <laughs> I don't have any trash bags on the cover. Well, here we're going to be getting home. Um, uh, there used to be an eight-hour maximum that you could work, but now uh, there's sixteen-hour minimum. Um, so you're like uh, four hours into the sixteen-hour shift. Okay. Keep kids. Keep kids. Oh. Keep kids. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. Right. Yeah. yeah they, I don't want them to have your intelligence. Why <laughs> <laughs> you split it in half and give if I have twins? Oh <laughs> yeah, that would be that would be half my intelligence. Yes. Um, <laughs> they, 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 they'd be, they would be they would connect to each other and even combined they would they would even maybe reach the potential of a full human being. Do uh, you think I can send them a substance for me someday when I don't feel like a human? You don't have what? Well, I mean, there's there's just three problems to deal with. It does sound like they get pretty monopolist. Right, yeah, you actually, you could send in twins. Actually, how old are they? Well, you know, I, I don't have them. Right, yeah. But how old would they be if you have them? They could be older than I am. Right, exactly. <laughs> well, if they were young, they, they, they yeah. could work. Yeah. And they didn't. They, they wanted to wear a hard hat or a steel-toed shoe. Oh, they would love the shoes. Well, too bad, because they don't have to wear them. They don't have to wear them because of you. There's no rules. You hire them out to you. They don't have to wear anything. You hide this vest? No. You don't have to wear anything. You, you have to do this nude? <laughs> 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 